guess what we're doing? We're antiquing. We're going antiquing. That's I'm so exactly excited. That's exactly how the other video started. Really? I believe so. Well, you know, go watch that other video if you want to confirm or disprove Tatum on that. All right. Today, we are in Broken Arrow for Kristen Chenoweth Broadway Boot Camp, which starts, well, technically it starts tonight with a meet and greet, but it starts in earnest tomorrow. So, we need to kill some time. And... Broken Arrow happens to be, Broken Arrow is right outside of Tulsa, Oklahoma, if you don't know. It happens to have a lot of really good antique shops. Um, in fact, I think my mom and I did a video last year at KCBBC, I'll link it up here, where we went antiquing at these same places. So we're gonna see what treasures we can find today. I have a bit of an agenda. I'd like to find something for a wall in my living room, a piece of art or something. I'd like to find maybe a couple of small Turkish style rugs. I'd like to find some little trinkets, like you said. I need to find a pot for a plant. Um, and also just whatever strikes our fancy, you know? We're just, tell them what you're on the hunt for, Tatum. I'm on the hunt for something um, that looks like a leprechaun or has red hair that I can send to my boyfriend to tell him that I miss him. He's camping in the wilderness right now, all alone. <laughs> we love him. Okay, in we go to the first place. First stop is Jade Treasures on Main Street and only serious antiquers bring a fan with them. <laughs> oh yeah, this place is good. This way first, Tatum? Yes. All right, let's go. Excuse me, look at this lamb that's a planter. Are you kidding me? I mean, I put something different in him, but <laughs> I might need him. He's so cute. Okay, look at the poodles. I love the poodles. <gasps> $25 for two of them. Oh, they're so cute. Tatum, show the vlog what you liked. Tatum's found the beanie babies. Huh? You got money. Even though you ain't got money. Look, we found a uh, little clothing section of this and Tatum what did you just say? Oh I'm gonna tear this stuff up. <laughs> She's about to tear it all up. By that I think she means look through all of it and get some of it. I, I don't really know, I don't know but it's cute in here. You guys look at this gem that I just found. A freaking bedazzler. Are you kidding me? <gasps> Do I buy it just to have it? it. Um, I'm fighting against it but I want this. <laughs> There's just already so many good things in this store. Just every every place we turn, it's like we're overstimulated almost by all the freaking stuff. It's so cute. Okay, I'm a sucker for the planters. This is right here by the checkout, so I'm just going to leave it right there and think about it. But I may be coming home with this one too. Look what we just found. Oh my gosh. It's a record player. A portable record player. A portable. It's teeny tiny. That is adorable. Okay, I want to buy this simply for the bowl of cherries inside. I want these cherries. But I don't think I, I don't think the cherries come with it. Tatum has found more Beanie Babies and she's freaking out. <gasps> Look at this duck. Are you kidding me? I gotta get that. <laughs> Okay, they've got amazing prices on longer burger baskets. Look, this one's only $15. Like, what the heck? We are straight up, yes, I've gotten my fan out, but we are straight up overwhelmed up in here because there's just something incredible around every corner. <laughs> Look what Tatum just found. It's a Crocs bag. It literally smells wow. like Crocs. It's so cute. How much is it? No idea, but it should be my camp bag. Oh my gosh, it could be. That's it? Is it clean on the inside? I mean, yeah. <laughs> That's awesome. It's a cute color too. Uh -huh. LOL. What? <laughs> okay, look at this vintage game board. I don't even know what game that is, but wouldn't it be cool on a wall? I think that'd be really cool hanging on a wall. Um, look at this amazing thing. Are you kidding me? It's $79, but I want it very badly. Also look at that cute little sign. Look what Tatum found. More Beanie Babies. They're putting her in agony. Because <laughs> she wants to buy them all. <laughs> Look at the creepy Princess Dianas. Oy. 
and the Elvis Beanie Baby. Get it from this angle. <laughs> it's terrifying. <laughs> it's really terrifying. Look, I found a laundry pod jar for like $7. Amazing. They have such great prices here, like so good. Ooh, look at that. That is beautiful. I love it. That would go good in the living room. Hmm. So like $20? That's insane. Gorge. <laughs> She's in agony. <laughs> There's just so many peeny babies. <laughs> Ay, ay, ay. Oh my gosh, is that a duck? <laughs> I may need that. Look at that gorgeous buffet. Oh my gosh. I wonder how much it is. Oh, it's only $3.25. That's insane. I have, oh, I could put it in my dining room. It's too big. It's too big. It's very, very deep. Zam, I love it so much though. Wow, I'm obsessed. She's freaking found more baby beanie babies. How is this possible? This one has kangaroos. A squirrel. <laughs> that kangaroo is freaking cute. She's in agony over here. She can't leave them, but she has to. We can't show you because it's over there where those people are, but Tatum found the perfect redhead to send to Angus. <laughs> That's awesome. Oh my gosh. All right, so time to assess all of our purchases. Ay, yeah, yeah. Stay tuned for this haul because it's gonna be freaking good. This is just the first stop. Oh my gosh. Oh my lordy lord. So, a jillion hours later, what time did we go in there? Like 1.15 and it's now basically three o'clock? Yeah. Woo! That was so fun. Yes. Also very overstimulating. We both got really good hauls. We will show you when we get home. We're not gonna have time to go to the other places today. I'll still take you with me in this vlog if Tatum's not there because there are two, at least two more stores that I know of that are super freaking good, but we got a bunch of good stuff. So I'm excited to show you guys. So on to the next one, probably minus Tatum because she's got to go to camp. All right, it's a little bit later. I've ditched Tatum at the hotel. She is practicing her solo songs and resting a little bit before the meet and greet tonight. I have about an hour, so I popped on over here to these two stores that are actually together. Um, well, right next door, kind of. One of them is the sister store of the one we were just at, so it'll be really good. And then the other is this place called, I think it's called Vintage Phoenix. Yeah. Um, this is where I got my really awesome cream and gray vintage recovered chairs that are in my office at home um, last year. So I know I'm gonna find some good stuff in here. This one is more expensive than the other one. So we'll see what we come across. Um, but so we're gonna pop into this one and that one hopefully within an hour. I don't know if I'm gonna get through all of them in an hour. That's the plan, let's go. And we go to this one. Oh, Zam, I'm in trouble right away. Look at these awesome pumpkins. So cute in here, I love it. And this one has little carts, so that is a score right here. Ooh, look at this table. That is beautiful. Um, they have a vintage Girl Scout uniform over there. How random. But look at this mirror. It's like almost cute. I like it almost. <laughs> one is already not as good as the other one. It's still really good, but not as good. I think we'll get through it pretty quick. Okay, this thing is super cute. I think it's like a plant stand, maybe? Some sort of stand? I don't know, but I like it. Oh shoot, look at this awesome brass swan. I just have a thing for animals. $22, that's a little steep. Look at these really pretty fake flowers. Those are really nice ones. <gasps> Excuse me. I just can't even with all the brass animals. Oh my gosh. Oh no, somebody hold me back. <laughs> okay, I love this. I think it's perfect for a plant. Um, in my kitchen that I need a plant thing for, so I think I might get this. And it's 40% off. Okay, scratch that. I found this one that I love, 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 and it's on sale for 22. Look how cool these Christmas paper trees are. I love it. Look how awesome these bar stools are. $50, wow. That's a good price on those. Eek. Look at the tall house. Oh my gosh, I love it so much. Look at this one. It's so freaking cute. I love it. All right, last stop of the video. I only got that one planter in that last store. It was a lot of like um, 
handmade items. It wasn't so much like vintage as it was like just different boutiques for people. So it wasn't all that great, but this place on the other hand is absolutely freaking huge. So I don't think I'll have time to get to all of it today. I don't know, we'll, we'll just see how, how, how much we see, but it's like true vintage stuff. Look at that gorgeous piece. Oh my gosh, I love it. I don't need it, but I love it. I also love this, love that. So many longer burger baskets. Are you kidding me with these lemon salt and pepper shakers? Seriously, they're so cute. Oh my gosh, $10. This was the stall I found my candlesticks in last year. So this one is definitely promising. Oh my gosh, do you guys know what this is? It's a vintage curling iron. You've got to be kidding me. Oh my gosh, that's so cool. Um, excuse me, I may need this. It's a vintage floral trash can, but I think I could use it as a planter. Oh, I love it. I remember asking last year about these chandeliers. They are unfortunately not for sale, but I love this one. Love it. You guys, look at this mirror. Freaking jackpot. $30, are you kidding me? Okay, that was extremely successful. I got three things in there and I only had about 20 minutes in there. So good job, Miles. I consider that a job well done. So it is so hot. I'm literally sweating from being outside for 0.5 seconds. Let's cut to the haul. Okay, I've got the little stuff inside to show you a haul with Tatum, but I thought I'd show you the big stuff so I don't have to carry it all in. I got this, which I think I'm gonna use as a planter. It's an old vintage trash can. I love it. And I think I showed you this awesome pottery piece. $22, you guys, this is just $22. I think this guy was 11. And then I ended up getting the brass and wood mirror, $30, like what the actual heck. And then I ended up getting this piece for $20. I just love it. It's kind of lithograph-like. I'm not sure if it's a drawing. No, it looks more like a painting, but um, I just love the vibe of it. And then this might be the best thing I got. So growing up, my parents always had a shelf like this. You hang it on the wall. It's like an apothecary drawer, I'm pretty sure, but you hang it on the wall. So this one says Hamilton and Co. at the top. Um, cause, so that, that was like the drawer pull. Um, but you hang it on the wall and you just put like, see this little jar, you put like little trinkets all inside of it. And my parents always had one in our house growing up and um, I saw it and I was like, oh my gosh, I cannot believe that. I got it for $29, I think. So, so happy with all of those big purchases. Love them, love them, love them. So there's the big haul. And let's go inside now because I'm sweating so much. It's like 157 degrees outside. And I'll show you the little stuff with Tatum. Okay, we are back in the hotel room. Gonna give you a quick haul before we go. It's later in the evening, we're all tired. So we're gonna do this quickly. Tatum, you wanna go first? Yes. So you can go call Angus. First, I got this bracelet. So cute. And I got another one. Four beanie babies. <laughs> A walrus. Maybe a walrus, a little poodle, a giraffe, and a moose. So cute. The poodle's my favorite. That is just so cute. Oh my gosh. And I got this little bandana. <laughs> That's cute. really cute. Yeah, love it. And then I got the piece de resistance croc bag. Croc bag. She's going to try to put gibbets in it, in those little holes. Yeah. So cute. Is that all you got? That was your That's thrift haul? How much was all yours? $63. <laughs> I should not be trusted with my own money. <laughs> okay, let me show you what I got. I had to get a box. I got a candle snuffer. I am so excited about this. I have wanted one for so long. Do you know how expensive these things are? And this one is so cool. Very like... I don't know, fun, funky looking. $9, it was $9, what the heck? Then I got the lamb, so freaking cute. Oh my gosh, the planter, I just love him. Then I got this jar for the laundry room, so cute, this was $7. Oh, the lamb was like $12, I think. Also for the laundry room, I got this awesome jar, which I think was maybe $9, so cute. Then I got this decanter. Um, which I thought was so cool. It's got, the stopper is cork. Isn't that awesome? 
for the bar. I just thought it was so pretty. I loved all the bubble glass on it. I think this was maybe like $8, $9 maybe. And then the greatest thing I've ever seen, <laughs> wooden mallard planter. I got it for $5. $5, look how cute he is. I love him so much. So that was it for our antiquing trip this time. Thank you guys so much for coming along with us. Let me know your favorite thing that we thrifted down below in the comments. Don't forget to like this video and subscribe and we will see you in the next one. Bye.